And here we have, if you're right about Bitcoin, something that's now lasted something along the lines of 15 years. And so I'm, I've been trying to understand if, in fact, you're right, and this is um, not just rat poison squared, but is not, is not a thing, when it would be unveiled as not a thing. That's predicting when speculation will end or, you know, when the gambling instinct will go away and when more people want to get out than are getting in. And I have no way of, if I thought I was good at that, I'd figure out a way to make a lot of money and different things. I, all I'm trying to do is buy good businesses. But I, the one thing I know is I, you know, I didn't like chain letters when I was a kid. I thought, why in the world should I send along a chain letter the next time when I could start my own? I mean, I've seen... People do stupid things all my life, and and I, I and I really I empathize with that. I mean, people like to play the lottery. They're going to get sixty cents back on the dollar, or whatever the number may be. And and states essentially, the numbers racket was something that you avoided. And then the government decided it was a source of revenue. And it's it's very hard to tell people that that if they're going to put a tax on essentially. Uh, uh, a sure loser for society, for the for the gamblers on the lottery on the whole, but they they're, they're appealing to the gambling instinct and and uh, you know it spreads. I mean, people love the idea they're going to make more money tomorrow, and it really drives them crazy if their next door neighbor is making a lot of money not knowing what they're doing, and they're just sitting there, and their spouse is saying, you know, why is that guy getting a second car, and why? Why are we missing this whole thing? And the gambling instinct is so strong. And and you had millions of people that were getting checks in the money and sitting home and finding out that they could have a roulette wheel in their house and they had all the appeals of gambling and that, that, that were used to get people to go to Las Vegas and you can do it in your home and they had money. And and we've had an explosion of 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 gambling, essentially. And... Uh, and, and you know, I like to bet on a football game if I'm sitting in Washington. It makes it more interesting. But I, I don't think I want to make a, a living trying to bet against the house ever. <laughs> I want to. If, if I were to get into gambling, I, I would want to own the roulette wheel and not be a roulette player. But, but uh, we haven't done that. But, but people all the time. Well, actually, on my on my honeymoon, in 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 uh, my first marriage, you know, we're talking when I was 21, and we went through. Las Vegas population, there about 20,000, a bunch of fellows from Omaha uh, and other places that, that, that bought the Flamingo after Bugsy Signal <laughs> met his maker sooner than he expected. And, uh, uh, and they welcomed me in because they all knew my Uncle Fred. And I looked at all these people who had flown thousands of miles to do something unintelligent as fast as they could. I mean, they just, they couldn't, you know, they thought the dice were hot or something like that. And... I thought, you know, I'm going to get rich in this country. I mean, if, if that's what people do, uh, I, I, I can be smarter than that. I mean, and, uh, so uh, I've watched it ever since, and it's fascinating to me. But the gambling urge is so strong throughout the world, and now you've created the perfect condition for it where states are legalizing gambling and, you know, what it does to, to football games. I mean, particularly if it just, you're just point-shaving, you know, which— uh, you know, the guy gets offered a million bucks, and it's like, you know, the the White Sox were back in 1920. Or so, you know, they did it for a few hundred dollars, but and you, you aren't even throwing the game. I mean, you're just you're just making sure that the, the spread is met. It's I don't I, you're not going to change the gambling instinct, but when the state has started sponsoring it, it's given a, a it's given a different. A, a, there's a different climate than before.